Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It is Manchester City, and they take on Sevilla. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson between the posts. Manuel Akanji plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Rodri plays with Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of the pitch. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. And this is how Sevilla will line up. Yassine Bounou is the goalkeeper. Fernando plays alongside Joan Jordan in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Rodri. On to Holland. Holland. Oh, big opportunity. There it is. The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace. And then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. And they're playing once again. Manchester City with the advantage. Effective looking pass. Oh, good looking run. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Lamela using his body to good effect. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Walker Rodri and the ball with De Bruyne and he's making progress will he find the net? it's gone in and well he might celebrate on the back of that Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him. So the ball rolling again, 2-0.
Well, they have the ball once more. Riyad Mahrez. Now with Ocampos. Well, they could... And the penalty has been given here. This to get back into it. In it goes. Coley converted. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. And City being afforded too much room. Ilkay Gundogan at the ready. And they deal with the threat this time. The danger not over. A City free kick forthcoming. Well, a judgment call for the referee. Many an official would have cautioned him. Well, the free kick taken, but saved easily by the keeper. Lamela Johan Jordan can they hit on the break Gomez well no pressure on the keeper poor cross Walker a bit of running room now on the wing Rodri, in behind for him to chase. Oh, yes! What a classy goal! And make no mistake, there aren't many in the game who would have the confidence to even try it. Well, just look at this. Magnificent agility, perfect timing and great connection. What a goal that is. continues and no shortage of goals 3-1 as things stand moving it forward Lucas Ocampos well nothing he could really do based on the cross not much time to make up his mind well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, they couldn't keep it. De Bruyne. De Bruyne. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Well, just the tackle that was needed. A 
Rodri. Now options are plenty. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Still could be dangerous. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. And the danger is still there. And the referee's verdict is penalty kick. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. The game continues then, and it's been all sitting. And so the half-time whistle is sounded here in Manchester. Well, many will regard him as the complete midfield player, Kevin De Bruyne. And how do you shackle him? It's well nigh impossible, Stuart. Well, what can you say about him today? He's been a real live wire, full of tricks, great feet and good goals as well. Top stuff. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Well, sloppy in possession. Gundogan. Now Holland. It's with Gundogan. De Bruyne. supporters want to see him have a go racing forward trying to catch them out and the counter-attack came to nothing De Bruyne De Bruyne giving it a try oh the crossbar is still reverberating and the danger is averted a lot to look forward to on the Champions League group stage front here on EA TV Live. It's Sevilla facing Borussia Dortmund. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. We can get more details on that injury situation from our man pitch side, Jeff Shreves. Jeff? He landed really heavily on his shoulder there. You can see oh, the what a chance this might be! Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And he's fired over the corner. Well, did his job defensively. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And Nesiri. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Chance to finish! A smart stop here. So a personnel change then. And taken short. Well, behind for another corner. So the corner played into the box. 
couldn't quite hang on. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop, and then the reaction. Jack Grealish. Well, that's a super ball over the top. He knew he had to make the tackle, and did. Wasteful from Sevilla. Mares. And deliver towards the back post. Oh, can you believe what we've just seen? I think we're going to be viewing that goal time and time again. Well, here it is again, and all you can do is admire the skill. That's a really clever goal, you have to say. A change in the offing for City. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Torres. Perfect challenge. Coming off the pitch. Number 8, Ilkay Gundogan. Teammates available. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. And number 20, Bernardo Silva. So almost at full time, and the home side very much in command. Stuart, what have you made of their overall performance? Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. Just 10 minutes remaining here. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Oh, what a perfect ball now. How about this? Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Johan Jordan. It's Torres now. Ocampos. Determined defending. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. And just five minutes remaining. Alvarez. De Bruyne. Here's Alvarez. Well, very effective play in possession. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. So, full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Yeah, it's so vital to get off to a quick start in these group stages. 
They'll be happy with the three points, but now they have to back it up in the next game. Six points and you're halfway there. Kevin De Bruyne, incisive and influential. How would you sum up what you saw from the Belgian? Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.